What is going on everybody and welcome back. We're here on the free to play count the road to max rank and we are doing stage 29 of infinite dragon ball history now I've been away for about a month. Um, so there's a bunch of uh, like stages I haven't done in the past month that have been released uh, So I'm just doing a bunch of cleanup work. Obviously infinite dragon ball history is easy quotations, right? It's really the missions that are difficult, but even the missions nowadays especially nowadays is actually not that bad so we're doing stage 29 against Super Saiyan, so we have to bring three gifted warriors and three uh, Super Saiyan characters. Obviously, this is easily met because um, there's so many great, you know, characters for either one. Gifted warriors, you know, Vegeta and stuff like that, right? So, so we're bringing Pure Saiyan, uh, what's it called STR uh, Super Vegeta, the transforming Fizz Vegeta, and then the Gotenks, who is also part of Gifted Warriors and Super Saiyan. And then everybody else here is just setups, right? So double god Goku rotation with Ajo Gohan and Tech uh, Tech what's it called? Tech Birdku on either rotation, then off rotating the other three, right? So, all right. Um, I could have brought other characters instead of the Transform Vegeta, which I feel like is something to note. But at the same time, I kind of just wanna, I kind of just I want to use the Transform Vegeta. I don't really get to use them all that often. And because he gets stronger as he transforms, towards the end, he will be good. But because since I'm off rotating, I don't really have to put a lot of thought into it. Now, STR Super Vegeta, now that's a different question. So, heals, his guard would run out well before we get to the final stage. However, his damage output is notable. And since I'm off rotating him, I don't have to worry too hard. Maybe towards the end, if it looks a little bit nasty, I might have to use Weiss just to protect him specifically. But everybody else here is going to be totally fine. So... Uh, funny enough, we're actually gonna off rotate. We're actually gonna off rotate the God Goku because we are going to, you know, <laughs> we're gonna get another God Goku on turn three. So we're not gonna waste our time. We're not gonna waste our time with that. So, I mean, also God Goku's intro would run out, but I figure by that point I can consistently get you know dodge and stuff like that, and he'll have. They'll both have decent defense for the most part, so that's what I thought about bringing uh, Spear Bomb Absorb Goku for the orb changing. Um, I also thought about using a dub, uh, like a uh, a friend transforming soup, uh, base Vegeta into Super Vegeta into Super Saiyan Vegeta. I thought about it, but I was like, nah. Let's just go with this route. All right, so we need to get the super tag, and then we'll be fine. We want to keep Goten some rotation. So hopefully, by the time we reach three, I believe we'll be. Hmm, I'm curious what we'll do. It takes a while for him to transform too, so it's like definitely a ways out for sure. Alright, now, now we can, uh, now we can start building up a little bit more pop. Now we can start setting up rotations. Alright. I thought about doing a AGO Gohan and the Bird Crew together, and then, like, transforming one of the God Gokus. I thought about it, but I was like, I'm saving those active skills for the very end, right? When we're fighting Vegito and stuff like that. And if we can clear out these stages pretty consistently, I think we'll be fine. Besides, a god Goku on each rotation is smart anyways, because of his guard and dodge and obviously his early orb changing and stuff like that. And his stacking, I need him on each rotation now that I can stack indefinitely to the point where once we get to the final stages, if I need a Whis, because you know, newer stages of anything, including to Battle Road, become more difficult. So M Drawing Ball history should be treated as no different. You just have to be careful. I feel like it's, it's all it really is. And since we're off rotating this guy, I'm not too concerned. But once he transforms into three Gotenks, 
Oof. <laughs> you, know what I mean? <laughs> you know what I mean? It's gonna be great. Alright, so we're gonna get the stack. We're gonna hopefully keep stacking with my boy here. Though I'm curious when he when whenever his easy eight comes around and STR metal uh, STR cooler come around, ooh, bro, like <laughs> it's is gonna be good, man. It's gonna be good. It's gonna be very good. Though that's probably a ways away, though. Though it's not not fair. I mean, the game has at least down a few years for sure. that it doesn't even matter it would be good though hmm Also, this feels good, just smacking these bosses, these enemies around when I was, I was getting smoked by Subaru, dude. Subaru has been a nuisance in my side for a minute. We're still not stacking up all too crazy. Let's go ahead and use AJ Gohan. Well, to be fair, I mean, we don't, we don't have a lot of his links active, right? But that's besides the point. He should be in the he should be in six hundreds now, man. What's going on? Come on, AJ Gohan. Maybe it's just the amount of super tense. He hasn't really produced all that much, huh? Maybe that's it. But Nah, we'll be I thought about doing bringing tech ultimate go home. I didn't look too cool. As much as I would love to see his huge defense and all that stuff, right? Like, I'm gonna use any of these characters. I need to, I need to broaden my horizon a little bit and use other characters for my roster. A lot of them don't, don't get love, you know? Well, we're still in the early stages. Like, I'm not too worried. Say that active skill for later. Um, we're gonna go ahead and do this. Where'd you go so far? They were. We're not allowing everybody to attack, though. That's the thing, too. We are not gonna transform into three yet. What are we looking? Yeah, we're looking pretty good now. I think I can get away with this. I want each other going to build up more. So we'll go ahead and do this, and we'll do. We need an LR Super Saiyan 3 Gotenks. That needs to exist. If that exists, it would be great. It'd be really good. That, like, every single character in every single, like, form needs a representation in, in LR form in some way. You know what I mean? Like, Super Saiyan 3 Gotenks, Super Saiyan Gotenks, Super Saiyan... You know what I mean? Like... Like, we already have LR God Goku. We need an LR standalone Blue Goku. You know what I mean? Like, an LR standalone Blue Vegeta. We already have Evolution Blue Vegeta. And we have them dueled up and everything like that. But standalone. Like, a standalone LR uh, God of Vegeta. An LR standalone, like, Majunior or Blue Piccolo or. Obviously, Kid Buu's a big one. Kami. Like, there's so many characters that need huge representations, right? Then just more Super Saiyan 3s or more base form Gokus, you know what I mean? We need full representation across the board in order to really get it out there. All right, so we're going to go ahead and throw Bird Koo in front. It's going to be enough. Yep. 
And then you, my friend, you can also stack, but I'm really just waiting for you to transform. But let's go ahead and do this. We're I'm pretty confident we're not going to kill here. Also, again, I need a... I really need... This Super Saiyan Goku. I need, I need to get more copies of them to build the full... Full of Eshiros, to potentially get Eshiros and stuff like that. I mean, if his 12 key also gave him defense, but it wasn't stackable, and it was more like... Like, for three turns, you get increased defense. You know what I mean? Like, that would be so good. Because it's technically not a stackable defense, but it gives him a little bit leg up to allow him to stack more better. And it's only on additionals, so you can, you, like, it can easily not work for you, you know what I'm saying? Like, that is totally a doable thing. This Vegeta is a stacking unit. I think the only thing is that he automatically transforms into final form, and his final form will clean him up, you know what I mean? Like, will allow him not, no longer to transform. All right, we're going to keep going with AGO Gohan. I think we'll find now not to continuously put Gohan in slot 1 to continuously stack. But we're we're just going to we're just going to do one more time. That way he can get a little bit over and we can swap over to God Goku. I hope Gohan doesn't kill. That way at least God Goku gets a one attack. Oh. Gohan's probably not going to listen to me. He either needs to crit or triple super and I win. This fight, yeah. What I'm saying. As soon as I say it, it happens, right? Why am I so lucky, dude? What the hell? Hmm. This is an interesting predicament. One, because I'm not gonna have guard with Goku. Unless I do some shenanigans like this, and then hope those AJL orbs drop. Well, and they do. Look at that. Easy money. Time to get serious. Dude, horrible. It's been a while since I've gotten a Doken attack, right? So I'm a little rusty. I'm a little. I'm a little rusty. <laughs> uh, we have to beat this event in 14 turns, and then we can get all the missions and we never have to come back here ever again. Unless I want to do some kind of challenge run, which probably won't happen, right? Because this is just a completion thing. Look at that. Oh, you can dodge now. Well, that's no way. But that's why additionals exist. Go Tanks could kill here. Not that Go Tanks. My Go Tanks. Maybe. Hmm. Okay. God Vegeta. Okay, final fight. So listen to this bad boy. And I'm just gonna let play.
like I'm a little too much for you to handle now, aren't I? I am Super Vegeta! I could have used uh, God Goku's active skill, but I, I wanted to win with Super Vegeta. And I knew that I wasn't going to die. I had full HP, type advantage, you know what I mean? Like, I was going to be totally fine. Like, I didn't have guard, but that really didn't matter, and I wasn't going to use an item. It's a safety skill. Like, I was going to be totally fine, even if I would have taken a super attack. But that is Infinite Dragon Ball History, stage 29 of Infinite Dragon Ball History, Super Saiyans. Um, I done all the state, I did all the missions. All the missions should be cleared. I did it within 14 turns. Right? Yeah, no, I did it within 14 turns. And I used all the necessary uh, team requirements for it. So, managed to clear it all the way through. Three things we didn't see. So, one, oh, well, four technically, but one of them doesn't count. Um, one, we didn't see Berku's active skill revival. Two, we didn't see Super Saiyan 3 Gotenks transform. Um, that's two, right? Three would be, uh, no, that's pretty much it. Oh, uh, we didn't see transforming, uh, blue go, uh, blue Vegeta all the way through. And the fourth one doesn't really count because it's impossible to get, uh, with the team comp and the enemy that we're fighting. AJL Gohan's transformation is Super Saiyan 2. So. GG. Uh, this is a team that I used to clear out the event and 100% it. Went pretty well. Could have gone easier. Um, but still went pretty well. So, I'm out of here. Hope you guys enjoyed. Let me know what you guys think. And I will catch you guys later. Peace. Take care.